Okay, so I wanted to take a look at Ruth Bader Ginsburg's spirit without bothering her. Just checking in with my guides to see how she's doing and what she's up to. And if I am correct that I am picking up um, on her coming into my readings, I, I, I just kind of have to know. Okay, so what I want to see is if Ruth Bader Ginsburg is active on the other side, because I feel like she is. And I'm sorry about the shaking. I'm trying out a new uh, camera. What do you? What would you call this clamp? And it has, you know, uh, it's it's a tripod. It's a flexible tripod. The only thing I don't care for is that it does tend to have a little bit of a bounce to it, so I do apologize for that. But um, other than that, it's pretty cool. So I'm afraid that if I do bother to even touch this, that it will only make it worse, so I'm not going to do that. All right, so I just want to I want to ask my guides and the ancestors: Is Ruth Bader Ginsburg acting from the other side to affect um, the choice of justice that ends up taking her spot since her death? So is she actively on the other side? Ruth Bader Ginsburg, is she acting from the other side to whatever degree she can to ensure a good choice ends up filling her position? Seven of Cups. This talks about dreams as well. All right. Ace of Coins. I'm feeling like this is probably to do with her wishes that we know of, that that position not uh, go, that she be alive to see who would take her position, or that she would live to, um, you know, basically see a new president. We know what her wish was anyhow. And this is the tower. I think this is the sudden and uh, the just the, the the passing. I don't think she expected that. This Queen of Cups is she a water sign? This could just be also speaking, if she isn't, of a certain quality. Ten of Cups. Yeah, this is about, again, we're being pointed towards a wish, a desire, and I also feel like this is her on the other side with, um, but really, now she's letting me know this has to do with the wish that she had before she passed. The hanged man. She wanted it delayed until there was a new president. And this, there's the Nine of Cups and the Ace of Swords. Perhaps she feels that that um, observation was denied, or not necessarily denied, but taken or cut from her, that choice. We 
have the tarot cat, bear, hello bear, she's had her lunch, so are you here to finish the reading? Um, let's just go ahead, we get the magician, oh, oh Ruthie, okay, don't mess with my cards there man, don't mess with my cards girl. My bear is a, is a female here. Female is... Yes, bear, right? Okay. Um, I don't think she took kindly to the fact that she ended up passing before her wish. She really is a little tenacious, notorious RGB. You know, she wasn't happy, I think, that she was not able to see that a better choice would be, you know, the way that she wanted. And I believe this is probably um, Mitch. She's talking about Mitch. Water sign, drunk drinker Mitch. Being tricky Mitch. Tricky Moscow Mitch. She's bringing that up. Ruthie wants to talk. Oh, she's saying, you know, he's ruthless to fill her position. Didn't get choice of words. Um, he's certainly up to doing whatever he has to in order to try to get somebody in there. You know, he's up to no good. Page of coins, but there is just something here. Maybe this is the the hint of the uh, person, the female that they would want in. According to Trump, he would pick a female. So I don't, not really sure, but this is the beginning of something also with a page of coins perhaps the beginning of that post that job that vacancy the person you know that post yes that post and she's pointing out to his shenanigans thank you Baron I'm, I'm, thank you for your uh, attentiones um, <clears throat> he's taking, she's pointing out, or I'm being pointed out by either, but I feel like, no, Ruth, I, every time I, I try to go through another, like my aunt, she's, I just feel like she's like, no, that's not necessary, I'm right here. I do, I feel like that. I Let me know if you feel the same way. I mean, I feel a bit silly even saying this, but um, definitely she's pointing to Mitch McConnell. <clears throat> she keeps doing it in every reading that I've done, uh, on and off camera, and his intent and activities that he'll be doing to um, further who he wants in there, that vacancy, that post. But there is a, I see a change with the Wheel of Fortune. And the Eight of Coins, usually a studious card, a card of repetition, a card of work that is done over and over. There's a re repetitious element to it in getting better and better, um, usually. But it deals with work. And in this place, well, let's just carry on. This is the Three of Swords. This can be illness, this can be heartbreak, something very painful, or division. And the Knight of Cups. I just don't, hmm. I get that with the um, 
Wheel of Fortune I think this is the activity that is going on to try to present this person they want. I also feel like Ruth feels like she works so hard and to not um, have that see that you know that 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 would be okay you know or to know that that would be in good hands is problematic you know to her being because she knew that he was up to no good Mitch and that the choice of person he would pick would be somebody that would be compromised that would compromise things that compromised offering you know she wasn't stupid she saw what they did to Obama's work that they tried to undo everything that he's done and I think she had feeling that they're to fill her post she knew that they were gonna put somebody in she wouldn't approve of we get the three of coins more than one person a group of people working this is the a queen of coins the queen of wands and judgment I feel like she's working with more than one other female on the other side possibly one two um, two to three others they're working together I believe this is an answer of yes she most definitely is Miss Ruthie and she's got company and they are going to help wherein I almost feel and wonder if these women were not people she knew in the legal uh, justice um, career and they are going to help bring about consequences for their judge they pass judgment their judgment Ooh, what is this this is some interesting tea what is this uh, all right um this is a definite for me answer to the question however my cynical mind may argue with me because it's always present with me trying to you know make sure I don't get carried away but this is definitely an answer logically to my question I feel like I'm being shown yep she's working on it she knows how Mitch is she knows his dirty rotten stinking plans and especially has her own unique point of view of them from where she's at now and she uh, has some compadres shall we say not compadres but some sisters working with her that were probably involved uh, that she had known um, and who are interested in injustice and were in the field I feel like of judge judges they may have been judges she knew other women let me put this on pause as a family member comes in it might be getting a bit noisy okay this is super interesting so I feel like she shows that she is indeed working from the other side and a couple of other assistants at her side there's a new beginning with the that is confined and again I'm shown to be clear ten of swords is a, is a an end to a long painful experience I see a whistleblower here 
with the Queen of Swords and it has something to do with health or financial issues with the Five of Coins, possibly related to the pandemic, Wall Street, I don't know, something. Because she reveals a secret, and I say whistleblower because I get this feeling, going in the right direction, no secrets. So I feel like this is, this is someone coming forward that feels, will feel safe enough to come forward. She's showing me something about that of a woman. Um, oh, the one that I saw as whoever is going to fill her shoes. I think I got this card. Hmm, that queen, I don't know, I'll have to go back to that. You see, I do so many readings that sometimes y'all, I gotta go back you get caught up in a flow of consciousness, and that's why it's great to record these. But most readers can will remember some stuff, other stuff. They go, "Oh yeah, okay." Uh, so, anyways, this is tr this is triggering a memory of of, uh, and especially with that um, high priestess card and the the six of swords of going in a better direction and expansion. King of, King of Wands. Uh, this is, I think this is to do with whoever that new person, there's somebody else that that's going to fill that seat, a woman. And she might end up, there's something about think, getting things going in a better direction. She has really, again, high intuition. And she's able to... Um, expand see ex I, I she's able to also see ahead she has foresight again and she has a great hindsight she's just a in, very insightful person this woman I'm feeling again off of her um, There's a lot of pressure. But I see that she's somebody that handles pressure well. And truly, as a justice, would be um, unbiased. Really able, capable of being unbiased, despite heavy, heavy energy. Or pressure. This woman be cute, cool as a cucumber. Whoever she is, I can't wait to see who this person will be. Because I feel like, um, yeah. Again, I'm being shown she's she's got a kind of a low key nature, um, not unlike Ruth. Some similarities there, and she is an independent thinker, a nonconformist. Um, she has substance. She is a woman of substance. She's done the work, and her own hard work has gotten her where she is. She's she's not been put in there without being able to back it up. Let me put it this way. That's what I'm being shown about this per, her nature. So again, I feel like Ruth is pointing me toward a woman that is going to end up um, filling her shoes as a justice and that Ruth is going to be working diligently on the other side to combat the nonsense that um, Moscow Mitch and friends are up to and are going to get up to expect it she's saying they're going to get up to it but somehow I don't know at the end of the day it's just not going to pan out for them or who, if they do get somebody in, maybe she'll flip on them or something. I don't know. But all I can say is Ruth is making sure that on the other side, that somebody that she approves of as filling her shoes gets chosen. So that's my reading for you on Miss Ruthie. She's doing fine, you guys. She's, she's at work already. 
and uh, I'm not going to disturb her. I can see it through my ancestors and the Creator what she's up to, and she's right. <laughs> she's right at work. So anyway, I will talk to you later. See you in the next video. Have a blessed Sunday.